and stay woo Stay awesome and stay what? Woo! Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And if you guys are today, I'm going to give y'all some tips on what to do when you get blood work. Because I know a lot of people are scared of needles. Like, I'm terrified of needles. Like, but since I got older, I, um, really, I'm still, like, little, I'm still a little terrified. But I'm going to show y'all, I'm going to show y'all, I'm going to show y'all what my trick is when I have to get blood work or any kind of shots. I'll tell y'all my trick. Subscribe to my channel, turn on post notifications, and let's get this YouTube video started. So the first thing is when you have to get blood work, ask them do they have a can they use a small needle? Ask them do they have a small needle, or say hey, or say can you use a small needle? Okay, so when you when what what's the difference between the big needle? The small needle is. That you don't really like it's like when they use a small needle, like you don't really feel it. They like okay. So last time I had to get blood work, I asked them to use a small needle, and they did. And so when I closed my eyes, she had already poked me, and I was out of my eyes, and and she was done. I was like, I didn't really, I didn't even like feel it, like type thing. Okay, so if you have like bring your headphones, like bring your AirPods or whatever, and play a favorite type of music to get you calm. Like the music will distract you from the needle, from the blood. The, the music will distract you. Okay, when you have to get shots, what you need to do is look away, turn your head, and close your eyes, and don't look at them. Sticking that needle, don't look at the needle. If you look at the needle, then you're gonna be terrified. You're gonna be like, you're gonna be like, you're gonna, you're gonna be like, you're gonna try to move around. So don't do, don't do that. Cause you might get hurt. So close your eyes, and boom, they're done. It's so like it's. I know, like okay, y'all remember when I was younger? Man, I remember I had to get shots at the doctor's office. I would be cutting up. Because man, I was like, I don't know, one time I got out of not getting a shot because I was so terrified at that time. I was like, oh, like, it's going to hurt, it's going to hurt. I was moving around and I'm moving around. I'm, I, I, <laughs> it was so, like, I was like, I still remember that. Um, I'm like, but now, since I got older, um, I'm not really that terrified of needles. <sighs> the next thing, we get blood work. It drink a lots and lots of water so they can find a find a rain and be more easier when you get your blood work. Cause I found out that when you drink lots and lots of water, it's easier for them to get your blood. It won't be so like hard for them like for them to, for them to like find a the rain. They say my veins are like small and stuff. They be having a hard time finding my vein. But um, and the next step is to be calm like if you're thinking about it you, you keep thinking about it and you're gonna get yourself all worked up over nothing so it's like getting blood work is basically nothing like just close your eyes turn your head play your favorite music ask them for a small needle yes get this ask them for a small needle because the last time i had to get blood work i, I asked for a small needle it worked it went so smoothly so Every time, every time I have to get blood work, I'm asking for a small needle because I I closed my eyes. She was done. I said, "What?" I was like, "You done?" She was like, "Yeah." I was like, "Man, I remember all the time I used to be terrified of getting blood work because I'm like going out. I was terrified of needles. Like I still am a little bit, but not that I don't." I don't, you know, I used to, I used to react in like, I used to, re I used to react in like a nervous way, cause I used to be like nervous and stuff, but now I, I stay calm, I, I close my eyes, I don't look at it, when you close your eyes, don't look at it, then you won't think, then you won't, just close your eyes, and relax your mind, and know that everything's going to be okay, 
those are some tips on what to do when you get blood work when you get shots yes so subscribe to my channel turn on post notifications and comment down below what other videos y'all want to see and let me tell y'all something stop jumping over puddles for folks that not gonna jump, not gonna jump in the river for you you got some folks that claim they love you they love you they, oh i love you you my bestie yeah they might be your bestie but when you today they, they talking behind your back they snake dissing you they dissing you and you ain't even knowing it you think it's all fun and gay and they laughing and giggling in your face <laughs> oh girl that's so funny <laughs> yeah but they talking behind your back and you don't even know it so watch who you watch who you be around keep your keep your circle small you don't need no big circle keep your circle small like this don't tell folk what you're doing when you make your moves, make your moves in silence. Don't tell them what you're doing. Level up. <laughs> you got this. Stay strong right there, y'all. And I appreciate y'all so much. Like I said, start jumping over puddles for folks who won't even jump in the river for you. Yeah, you got some folks that they think they, they say they love you. They think they say you did everything, you did bestie. Yeah. Be careful who you hang around. Okay? I always say this. Respect people who respect you. Be there for people who be there for you. Stop being there for people that, that, that don't care about you. Stop jumping and running. Trying to be there for folks that don't care about you. They say they care about you, but they really, but they really don't. You hear you heard what I'm saying? And you know I got to represent Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Tampa Bay Buccaneers. My favorite football player, Tom Brady. Yes, Tom Brady, number 12. So those are some tips on what to do when you have to get blood work or when you have to get shots. So comment down below what video y'all want me to do. Please comment down below. It really helps me out. When y'all comment down below and tell me what y'all want to see. Because it helps me out a whole lot when you comment down below and tell me. I want y'all, I want to hear y'all ideas. What y'all want to see on my channel. This is our channel together. Y'all the one made me popular. If it wasn't for y'all, I wouldn't be popular. So I'm doing y'all a solid favor. Is I'm doing y'all doing y'all a favor when you want to ask y'all. Please comment down below. So please comment down below and to all you out there give thanks to your subscribers and followers give thanks to them and thanks to god too because without god and your subscribers and followers you won't be where you're at today your channel your channel won't be popping if it wasn't for your subscribers and followers they don't want to watch your videos all the time they don't want to watch and likes it i'm just saying when you get big, don't forget to don't forget about your your subscribers and followers. They're the one got you famous. Remember that respectfully. I love y'all. Bye.